the morning, he is pounding on my door with a liter of gin in his bloodstream and 30 bucks worth of White Castle hamburgers in case I'm hungry. This isn't as bad as when he belts Ricky Martin with feeling for his best friend who died in a mob-related incident I suspect is either not dead or never existed. I trust him so implicitly. I wrote down the serial numbers to all my stereo components before he moved in. Hey, but he's really cute. Listen. You want to spend your time registering for online dating services, calling love lines, or reading personal ads? You do what you got to do. But I need another boyfriend like I need to exfoliate with a cheese grater. My romantic history reads like John Bobbitt's diary, I cannot be trusted. You show me 50 handsome, responsible, upstanding men and one loveless, self-absorbed creep. I'll take the creep every time. I like a mean and inconsiderate. The kind of guy who hides guns in my hall closet. The kind of guy who lets me know it's over by bringing his new girlfriend home to spend the night while I'm visiting from out of town. Yeah, baby, rest assured, if I'm into him, he's probably got a three-year-old locked in his trunk. You say you want to fix me up with a nice guy. Yeah, no thanks. I pick my lovers from a lineup. Find me the most despicable, insensitive, compulsive, fucked up asshole in any given room. That's my sweetie. Yeah. Does this sound better? Okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. I'll make a deal with you. Why don't you wait unwittingly in the car while your boyfriend steals $50,000 from the bank, then come talk to me about puppies and ice cream. Oh, I'm not saying that all men are assholes. I'm not. I am telling you that I am a fucking moron. I bailed that guy out of jail, the White Castle guy. Idiot! Is it because I'm afraid of real commitment? Do I think... Bastards are more exciting. Am I looking for someone like my father who bought mom a shotgun for Mother's Day? That's true. Who cares? Gentlemen, you want to take me out for a nice romantic dinner? Make it Arby's and I'll melt. Score extra points if you forgot your wallet at home. You bring me flowers, they better be plastic or dead. Get me chocolates, you're gonna wanna eat half of them before you get to my house. Forget my birthday and I will put out because no one ever won me over by being a nice guy. You want a piece of this action? Yeah, you better be prepared to leave me stranded in a bar in Phoenix where the bathrooms are labeled poles and holes. I just can't control myself around a motherfucker. That's how it is. That's who I am. So, fuck it. Forget it. You say smoking takes years off my life? I say that's just less boyfriends to rob my apartment while I'm at work. You say I'm going to end up a spinster? Well, I've already started collecting the cats, so all you jerks out there, set your crosshairs on another target. And if you need me to explain this to you, okay, yeah, call me later. We'll discuss it over drinks. <laughs>